All right, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, it is 3.20 in the morning. We're at the gym. It is leg day today. Okay. And, uh, yeah, it didn't work out yesterday. Took the day off. Workout the other day was uh, not the greatest, so uh, let's hope what happened the other day doesn't happen today, and uh, yeah, all right, solid intro, lots of words to have been said at 3.20 in the morning, let's get in there and let's get after it, shall we? All right, real quick, you can probably see it, my face, yeah, it looks kind of like pretty red not too bad so I'm thinking well, let's let me let me run this down for you so the other day I tried a new pre-workout because sometimes you know I like to try different ones only sports approved ones and this one was not only informed choice but it was informed sport which is even fucking better so I was like sweet let's try it and it was Seabum's brand that, this is the one I tried the other day and I think it's the one that gave me the the headache that I got because it had 200 milligrams of uh, Himalayan salt and I think that just dehydrated the shit out of me because I took it right when I woke up to get me to the gym here and to wake me up so I'm probably never gonna take that again and that was only like half a scoop I took uh, and then anytime not any time. Some of the time, I'd say one out of every four times, like 25% of the time when I take the new Spitfire uh, pre-workout. They're uh, Spitfire 2.01. My whole body like goes red and just gets super itchy. I love the itch, but it's just weird how everything gets red. That's okay. I'm, I don't feel like how I felt on fucking Thursday, which is good. But yeah, this redness will probably last a good half hour at least. And uh, yeah. Gonna get a nice warm up here. I just figured I'd that let you guys know just in case you're watching. You're like, why does his face look so fucking red today for some reason? Uh, that's why. Uh, I have. I know that no one else, other than I'm pretty sure just me, has had this reaction to their one type of pre-work. Every other, they made like four other kinds of pre-workout. I've had all of them. This is the only one where I've had any sort of weird. Click in. Okay. Really? Nothing? Yeah, whatever. All right. And this is the only one where I've had some sort of weird reaction, and it only occasionally happens. That's it, though. My face just goes red. I don't feel weird or anything. I feel like how, you know, awake and shit. Like, I honestly love taking it. I just don't love the red aspect that it gives me, which is super fucking weird. <laughs> to go let's throw another plate on maybe two more plates on I don't know my legs are feeling stronger I'm feeling like a big boy today oh, just a money noise that's the only beauty of leg day is your legs are way stronger than the rest of your body so you're able to use way more plates so you're able to make way more of that noise we're gonna try four plates on here today okay oh, I love I'm starting to like not love, but like doing my leg workout because I it's noticeably already helping with my Achilles pain and with my knee pain. It's kind of cool, like how it's, it's not just helping, but it's noticeably helping, which is sweet. Okay, 20-ish reps. That's fucking really good, actually. See, when I first started doing leg, 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 leg day a couple weeks ago, three plates, like even two kind of, but three plates, hurt my knee. Now we're doing four plates, and it hurts very slightly, very slightly. Three plates was like fucking painful a few weeks ago. <sighs> That's awesome. In order to train as hard as possible, you must contain a clear image of your purpose. Once your goal is sharply but realistically defined, all that remains is carrying out your plan. 
Don't, however, worry about your individual potential. Potential is only the expression of a possibility, something that can be expressed accurately only in retrospect. In other words, you'll never know how good you might have become unless you try. So let's get with it. Just in case I put all that on the video, that is not me as Mike Menser. I was just kind of saying it along with him. Okay, we're doing no plates for this. Uh, the whole point is to get the deep, deep, deep squat to work on my, my knee pain. nice feel the full stretch break deadly all right here's how these sets you're gonna go we're gonna do four plates drop it down to three drop there's the drop set that's one set next set we're gonna start at three drop it down to two done there's that set next set we're gonna start with three then two then one done next set we're gonna start with two plates and then we might drop it down to one and then we're done all right so it's pretty much just gonna go Four, three, three, two, and then like three, two, one, and then two, one, and there you go. Easy maths. Good set. Now we got three two, possibly three two one. And one of my favorite things you guys do. I'm probably gonna have to say this again in the gymnastics videos because more people watch the gymnastics ones. But uh, when you guys call me out on shit, you might not think I like it, but I always try to point it out as much as I can. I love when you guys call me out on shit. That's like one of the biggest purposes of these videos is for you guys to go, "Oh, you forgot to do this. You forgot to do this." Because a lot of times, sometimes I actually just forget. Other times, I consciously avoided it, hoping you guys wouldn't remember. But luckily, one of you always does, and you call me out on my bullshit. And then I end up working it the next day. That's how I ended up training a lot of skills, new skills, old skills, this and that. A lot of stuff gets trained extra, or actually gets trained somewhat, because of you guys calling me out on it. Like my kip on the P-bars, that was a big one. I was, I legitimately just always forgot to work it. But then I, last year I started training a whole bunch because you guys kept reminding me. Thank God, because I don't know why. It just seemed to be something I just couldn't remember. But yeah, all right, enough talking. Let's just get her going here.
또 Fucking son of a... Oh, let's get her all the way down to one, shall we? All the way down to one plate. Where the going gets tough, and the tough gets going, and you feel the deepest burn you ever feel. I'm gonna pass now. Uh, uh, looks good. Looks good shit. Oh, uh, you know when the, you know when it starts to hurt so much that you don't even have the energy left to make a facial expression of how much it hurts. Yeah, that's about where we were at with that set. Oh, I think I'm stuck on the floor actually. I think I'm. I can't. How the fuck am I supposed to get up? Oh, oh yui, there we go. Oh gosh, I can like feel. Oh, my pants are about to. Not even gonna say that. Not gonna say that. I was about to say explode at the end there. Not saying that. Oh, I think it. Yeah, it's too far there, buddy. It just fell on its own. Let's not. And then there. Go in it. Yeah, what's your issue with me? Fuck you. Okay, next set. Uh, we got three plates on there. We're gonna go three, two, one again, because that was just so much fun. My quads are on fucking fire. I'm gonna 
cry. I start crying. Hold it, you bitch. Fuck. Oh, okay, I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm just gonna shut the camera off. Uh, just, for, just for a minute before I exit. All right. I put one more plate on. We got two plates on there now. Uh, I think that's gonna be a PR at the moment. I don't think I'll be able to do any more than two plates. If all you ever watched was my leg workout videos, you'd think that I love doing my leg workouts. I don't. But I enjoy having less knee and Achilles pain during training for my sport. And if I have less pain during training, it means I can be better at my sport. Because that's all that matters to me. It's being the best I can possibly be at my sport. But if me doing stupid Lag workouts helps with the knee pain and everything for me to be better in training. And I will do the hardest goddamn lag workout you've ever seen in your life. Sorry to the Lord for cursing his name in vain. But I will train legs like it is my favorite thing to train if it's going to help me with gymnastics. That's all you got to know. Okay, enough chit-chatting. Let's have some fun here, shall we? Oh, okay, just don't think about it. Ah, uh, uh, these are shaking. That's good, there we go, we're done. We're done, I'm not going down a single plate again. We've already done that like 20 times. So we've went way beyond what I said the planned sets were, holy shit. Let's go over to the next station. Uh, all right, oh, we just worked out my quads like they owed me money. That was good. They still hurt, it feels great. Pain is progress, the right kind of pain is progress. You know what, sometimes your motivation needs to be just knowing that no one else is willing to do it or that no one else is doing it at the moment. That's gotta be your motivation some of the time. Okay, yeah, I felt like, mm, let's go a little heavier, I guess. I was gonna start nice and light for a nice light start, but I fucking nailed the back and now we have to go heavier. Oh. 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 Fuck. I had a remote for the camera. This is this is a struggle. Mm, fuck, I wish I said this sooner in the video. I'm gonna say this in the gymnastics video as well. Comment movie suggestions, all sorts. Not just like one, just a bunch. Like a whole list if you want. Hopefully, hopefully someone's watching this part. I'm gonna say it again right at the start of my gymnastics video too. So I have something to watch Saturday night. Alright. Next set.
Signature move to enter. Legs up, legs round. There we go, money. Go till you can't go no more. We up the weight for the set, by the way. We upped it. Yep. We upped it by 15 whole massive ass pounds. I wish they were playing I wish they were playing Henry Danger or Shits Creek, something on something good on the TV. Fuck this heavy ass weight. Oh, now we got commercials and ads. This is good. This is. <laughs> Fuck! No, I can't get me out of this thing. Ooh. That was a good set, that was an all right set. You know, not bad, not bad. Probably, probably had a few more reps left in me, but you know, once it started to get a little bit hard, I figured I should give up. Train to mediocrity, you know, don't train till it hurts. Right, because you want to stay small. I found this new trick. I just like, I walk over there, stop the camera, start again, and I walk back over here. And by the time I get over here, it's already been 10 minutes, so I can just start my next set. Because it's, it's so hard to, it's hard to walk right now. Lift you up. Yep, there you go, buddy. Next, next. Yeah, there you go, buddy. All right, I'm gonna put you through a whole lot more hell because we're just having so much fun. All right, next set.
reset. We're dropping one pin at a time. It's the most painful way to do it. <laughs> Get out. All right. Now to celebrate. Beating the shit out of my hamstrings and quads. I'm going to beat the shit out of my calves. All right. Start with 200. All right, next set. So let's put it up to 300. Roll up the pants a little bit better so you can see the nice calves. We've done 200, we've done 300, but have we done 400 motherfucking pounds? No, we haven't, but let's do it. <sighs> Are the going gets tough. Such a deep run. Ooh. I keep going. Now down to 300 pounds. Now down 
down to 200 pounds. Fuck this. I'm pushing up right now. I'm trying, by the way. Oh. 100 pounds. Okay. Uh, no pen. Oh, I gotta hold it, I guess. Get the fuck out of my way. I'm pushing. I'm pushing. Oh. It's good. Let's try something cool here. You ready? That'd be cool, hey? That's just what that's what we're gonna do for the next 10 minutes until the next set. Oh, that one was close. Oh, oh that was like it it was like in it like that, and then it fell out. Let's go. That's good enough. That's halfway. Fuck you. Alright, that's a sign. It's a sign we do 80 pounds to start and to failure, oh yeah? To celebrate. Uh. Oh, it already burns. First try. Oh. See guys, you don't need to play on your phones in between sets and watch Instagram videos. Just play with the pin. Just fuck, was that ever cool getting that shit in? Because either you do this and you get it and it excites you for your next set, or you don't get it and now you're pissed off for your next set. Either way, your next set's gonna be great. Oh. Okay. Okay, the legs feel great. This is the last set. So we're gonna make it hurt, of course. Yeah. Fun. Ah. Good. I can't feel my legs at all, like at all. Yeah, that's the hardest it's ever been to walk up. Those things, that sucks. All right, once again, didn't bring shorts, forgot. Just fine. Uh, I can't even flex them. Oh, okay. 
You can see the veins, I think. Kind of there. Oh, okay, that's good. Right down here. The thumbnail might just be, wow. Uh, gonna go throw some bales of hay. Do not tuck that in. The thumbnail might just be me like mid wrap like this. Uh, because that, that hurt to fucking flex. My lights are on fire. Okay. Come here. Come here, you. All right. That's the end of this video. It's a really good workout. You want to know why it was a good workout? Because I took Spitfire Nutrition. Legitimately, that played a big role. But yeah, this was a good workout. We trained probably too hard, honestly. Because now I have to train two more times today for my sport. So that's good. And uh, yeah. Watch full video, enjoy, glad to hear that. If you watch the full video, let's comment the word pain. So we felt a lot of pain today. P-A-I-N, pain. All right, thank you for watching. See you guys in the next video. Bye, love you.